New conversation. Good morning, Mary. How are you today? Good morning, Michael. I am good, thanks. All right, and you? Mary, do you have some time? I need to talk to you about something. Of course, Michael. What's on your mind? Mary, can you help me with this report? I'm a little stuck. Of course, I would be happy to assist you. What do you need help with? Michael, the meeting is scheduled for 2 p.m. Don't forget. Thanks for the reminder, Mary. I will make sure to be there on time. Mary, I heard you're going on vacation next week. Where are you going? Yes, I'm going to Hawaii for some relaxation. I can't wait. Michael, would you please pass me the stapler? Of course you are. Mary, have you finished your client meeting presentation? Yes, I just completed it. I will send it to you for your review. Michael, did you see the new project proposal on your desk? Not yet. I'll take a look right away. Mary, do you have any suggestions to increase the productivity of our team? Yes, I think it might be useful to implement a new time management tool. Michael, let's have a coffee on our break and discuss the upcoming project. Looks like a plan, Mary. I'll meet you in the break room. New conversation. Hey, do you know where the school library is? Of course, on the second floor of the main building. Thanks a lot. I need to return some books. No problem. Are you new here? Yes, I just started this semester. By the way, my name is Sarah. Nice to meet you Sarah. Alex. If you have any questions about the campus, feel free to ask. Thanks Alex. I can accept this offer. I'm still trying to find my way. Don't worry, I was in the same boat when I first came here. You will understand. New conversation. Good morning Mary. How are you today? Good morning Michael. I am good thanks. All right and you? I'm fine like that, thanks. Are you ready for the software project meeting? Yes, I have prepared all the necessary documents. Great. Let's start by reviewing the project timeline. Certainly. We are on our way to meet the deadline. Good to hear. Any problems with the development team? No, they work efficiently. Communication is seamless. Great. What about the budget? Do you have any concerns? The budget is within the limits we set at the beginning. Perfect. Let's discuss the milestones ahead. The next milestone is scheduled for next week. Are all team members aware of their duties? Yes, I have clearly communicated the responsibilities. Good job, Mary. Your leadership makes the difference. Thank you, Michael. Thank you for your support. Now let's talk about potential risks. Have you identified any? There is a slight risk in third-party software integration. Let's pay attention to this and make a contingency plan. Acceptance. We should also schedule regular progress meetings. I was thinking the same. Weekly meetings will suffice. This works for me. It ensures that everyone is in harmony. Speaking of compliance, how is our customers' feedback? They are satisfied with the progress made so far. This is great news. Customer satisfaction is our priority. Definitely Michael. We aim for a successful project delivery. Is there anything else we should be covering today? I think we've covered everything on the agenda. Wonderful. Thank you for your commitment, Mary. Thank you, Michael. Let's continue to work together. Definitely. Let's turn this project into a big success. I could not agree more. Have a nice day.
You too, Mary. Until our next meeting. Bye bye Michael. New conversation. Hello Miriam. How are you today? I'm fine like that, thanks. Alright and you? Did you go to class this morning? Yes I did. It was boring as usual. Hey Michael, would you like to have lunch together? Sure. Where do you want to go? I have a lot of homework to do tonight. Let's study together in the library. Do you have any plans for the weekend? Not really, maybe we'll watch a movie. I'm considering joining a club on campus. This sounds like a great idea. Haven't you met our new teacher yet? No not yet. Is he nice? I need to get some food after class. Can I come with you? I need a few things too. Have you seen the new coffee shop downtown? Yes, I heard it's really good. Let's check it out. What's your trade, Mary? I specialize in psychology. All right, and you? I'm having trouble in math class. Don't worry, I can help you study for the next exam. Do you like living on campus? Yes, it's convenient but the dorms are small. I'm going home for the holidays. That sounds good. I will stay on campus. Let's go to the gym together tomorrow. Of course I need to start working more. Have you been to the art museum in the city center? Not yet, but I would love to go sometime. New conversation. Good morning Mary. How are you today? Good morning Michael. I am good thanks. All right and you? I'm fine, thanks for asking. What can I bring you today? I'd like a cappuccino and a chocolate croissant, please. Of course, a cappuccino and chocolate croissant comes. Do you want this place or go? I'll take it here, please. I want to enjoy the relaxed atmosphere. Of course, please sit down. Your order will be ready in a short time. Michael prepares cappuccino and croissant. By the way, Michael, have you tried the new pastries here? Not yet. Mary, are they fine? Yes, I tried the almond Danish dish yesterday and it was delicious. Sounds tempting. I'll have to try it next time. Here's the cappuccino and chocolate croissant, Mary. Thank you Michael. Looks great. You're welcome. Enjoy. Michael, do you have any plans for the weekend? I'm thinking of going for a walk on Saturday and maybe watching a movie on Sunday. Alright and you? I plan to visit the farmer's market on Saturday and read some books on Sunday. That sounds good. We both have relaxing weekends ahead of us. Definitely. Oh, Michael, can I have the bill, please? Of course, here it is. Your total amount is $8.50. Here is a $10 bill. Save the top as a tip. Thank you very much, Mary. I appreciate it. Have a nice day. You too, Michael. Bye. Goodbye, Mary. Have a nice day.